Hey, my name is Asana, uh, Asana here, Braden, 172 West 124th Street, between 7 and Lennox. And then I'd like to talk to sisters who do the hair. I would like to invite them to come. Don't be afraid about Ebola. I know if you have a Ebola, you cannot even get to New York City with them, let people know it. But I hear a lot of people don't want to come to African Hebrew because they think we're all African. We might, they might get the Ebola from us. No, that's wrong. We're also fighting for Ebola, but we're not going to see somebody who just came from Africa right now, and the next day, the person will be on the shop. And even in Africa, it's not all country who have a Ebola. So when we see them and then we try to ask them if they want their hair done, they say, no, nobody want to come to African people to get Ebola. So that really, really hurt me. And then I know we guys, we've been here for 20 years, 25 years. We are Americanized now. So for people to scare of us like that because of the crisis who happened back home, it's not fair. Usually this is the busy time, but this month, uh, we don't know. We never see the Thanksgiving slow like that. So that's why we're scared. We don't know what is going on. Usually everybody want to greet their, greet their mother here, their daughters here. But today is Sunday. It's not any customer here. And then when you ask them, they say, listen, I don't want to go to the African place to get Ebola. And we've been here for 20 years. How can we get Ebola? And that's not nice. So I want my voice... I want them to hear and know you don't get Ebola from African hair braiding in New York City.